Hey there, everyone. I hope you're all doing well. Are you having a great time with the Table Manager plugin? Well, if you are, I've got something exciting to share with you today. It's all about two fantastic features this plugin has in store, sort and filter. These features can truly elevate the look of your charts, making them appear more professional. Plus, they'll enhance your workflow efficiency. So, without further ado, let's dive right in and explore these remarkable features together. Now, let's take a look into the Table Manager list. Within this feature, you can categorize your tables into different groups. Sorting and saving is as simple as dragging a table to its desired location. Right-clicking on a table provides options to rename, duplicate, or delete it. When you click on Edit for a table, it'll seamlessly transport you to the editing interface. To facilitate graph demonstrations, let's go ahead and select a theme. Editing a cell is a breeze, just a single click on it will do the trick. Look to the top row, where the content, essentially the value of the table, is displayed. You can effortlessly edit it by typing in your desired value. Alternatively, you can double-click on a cell to bring up the editing tab. For those seeking more advanced customization, the HTML editor in the toolbar can transform a cell into an HTML cell. Once a cell becomes HTML enabled, it behaves differently from a regular cell. Double-clicking on it opens up an advanced editing interface where you can configure various options for your HTML content, like embedding an image from your WordPress media library. After making adjustments, simply click outside the cell to see the embedded image in your graph. This feature greatly enhances the visual appeal of your graph. A right-click on a cell reveals a pop-up tab with editing options specific to that cell. This includes the straightforward copy and paste function, as the name implies. You can copy a cell and then paste it into another to create a duplicate. Within the Format tab, you'll discover a range of options to enhance your table, each with its own unique applications and characteristics. Today, however, let's focus on the Filter option. Enabling this feature activates a filter on your table. To witness this in action, let's navigate to my Elementor page and insert the table into my content. Once we've added and previewed the table on the front end, you'll notice white boxes atop each column. Here's how the filter operates, simply input a value or text that corresponds to the table, and the filter will swiftly display the search results, saving you valuable search time. This filter operates in real time, as soon as you enter a value, the matching results are displayed instantly. It's an excellent time saver, especially when managing large tables. Now, let's explore the next formatting option, the sorting format. Like with the filter, once you activate this feature, you'll notice the immediate impact on the front end. The sorting format introduces an arrow-like icon beside the header title of each column. This allows you to sort values in either ascending or descending order. When I click on the sorting button, you'll notice the order of my chart changes based on the column I've selected. It's a convenient tool to organize your table exactly how you want. Finally, and now that really the end, Let's check the third party integrations that the plugin has. Many WordPress plugins are integrated with their respective content blocks, widgets, or modules, whatever their names are. The most popular you may know are WooCommerce, Elementor, or DV Builder. Also, and that's more interesting, many sheet formats are supported for import and synchronization, like Excel files, CSV files, or OpenOffice files. This plugin is available at $49 with all the features we've just shown in this video. And that's for an unlimited number of websites, no domain limitation, no support limitation. Thanks for watching this video. If you're watching this video from YouTube, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay informed about new plugin features. And of course, you'll find all the useful links we've talked about in the description. Have a nice day, bye.